Hi everyone, and here's our devotional for Monday, March 15th, 2021, entitled True Healing. O Lord, be gracious to me and heal my soul. Psalm 41.4 When Jesus healed a paralyzed man who had been lowered through a roof by his friends, the first thing he said to him was, Son, your sins are forgiven. Mark 2.5 Jesus, the Lord God, who knew the man better than he knew himself, identified his main issue to be spiritual. Of course, this left everyone around Christ surprised. In their eyes, the paralytic's primary problem was physical. This goes to show that sometimes we'll seek out Christ for external issues, our health, finances, relationships, or what have you. However, what he addresses as we spend time with him in prayer is something deep within our souls. This may be astounding to us because we think we know what, what's causing us pain, but Jesus sees the true root of our woundedness. Of course, Jesus answered the exterior troubles we bring to him as well. He empowered the paralytic to pick up his pallet and walk. He does the same for you. However, what's so important to understand is that your Savior wants you to be healed fully, not just on the surface, but inside out. So never ignore what Jesus tells you or pinpoints as the true issue. Trust him as your great physician and accept his order of addressing your needs. Jesus, I trust you to address the true root of my pain and heal me. Amen. Wow, that's a tough one, isn't it? I read this book by, oh, I wish I knew what it was called, by Isabella MacDonald Alden, where um, she fictionalized that part where um, the guy, you know, Jesus said your sins were forgiven you. And in the story, the guy kind of had rebelled and he kind of went away from his family and away from God and everything. And while he, an accident happened or something happened that caused him to be lame or whatever but yeah and it's like jesus knew that the man had sinned and everything um let's see how horrible singing sounds with these dentures there's a song by rebecca st james that i love it's called go and sin no more um i'm gonna butcher it but look it up on youtube it's a great song it goes go and sin no more he said, I will not condemn you, I've forgiven, I'll forget it all. Go and sin no more. My child, let me remind you, it is I who lead and guide you as you go. Praise God for that. <laughs> I love that. It's based on a different scripture, but yeah, it's really awesome. So, may the Lord bless you all and be with you till tomorrow.